and we're told to wash our hands a lot because of the pandemic to obviously uh, keep them clean and not get the COVID. But are your hands getting dry and cracked from all that washing? It's necessary to help stop the spread of germs. But what damage is all that washing doing to your skin? Well, Dr. Peter Helton, a board certified dermatologist, joining us by phone to tell us how to keep our hands healthy. Uh, doctor, good morning to you. I guess the question, how much is too much when it comes to washing your hands? Good, good morning. Um, well, that's a good question. You know, prior to COVID, people washed their hands probably three times a day. Now people are washing their hands like 10 times a day. Right. Um, but the problem with that isn't necessarily keeping your hands clean. It's keeping the moisture barrier intact on your skin. Your moisture barrier on your skin is job is to stop the outer environment from coming into your body. So if your hands are dry and cracked, then those little micro cracks allow things to come into your, inside your body. I mean, prior to that, we were only worried about germs and dirt, but now we're worried about things like COVID. Yeah, it could make things even worse. So, so what's the solution to all of this? Well, the American Academy of Dermatologists recommends to apply a, a moisturizer to skin after uh, after washing your hands. Mm -hmm. um, and you know, the drawback to that is there's several choices of moisturizers out there to use. Um, and uh, I, have, I have a couple favorites, but the, the goal is after you wash your hands, you should probably apply some sort of emollient to it. You know, you can spend a lot of money on moisturizer. You can, you know, buy cheaper. Is there any one that's better than the other? Well, like I said, I, I, I have a favorite. You know, you know, the one I like most is something called uh, Gloves in a Bottle. Okay. Um, and uh, I, I discovered that probably 20 years ago. And, and the nice thing about that is it, it's got a, uh, a polymer in it that actually attaches to the top layer of skin and, and lasts for about four hours. So, you know, typically, if, you know, if I tell you you're going to wash your hands and moisturize after each wash, you know, the chances of you actually doing that are kind of slim. <laughs> um, you know, you might be able to get it on two or three times a day when you're at home, but if you're washing your hands out, out and about, you don't have all your supplies with you. So the reason I like gloves in the bottle is it tends to last longer than most moisturizers do, and it locks the moisture into your skin um, and, and keeps, keeps your skin from getting dry. Well, what is it that's toughest on your skin? Is it the alcohol in, in the wash that we use, or is it just washing in general? Well, you know, water will dehydrate your skin, so just, you know, water... 10 times a day will we'll, we'll do the trick. You know, you throw alcohol on top of it, and that takes that, that melts all your natural oils whose, whose job is to repel water. Um, so, you know, alcohol is probably worse, but, you know, water is not, not much better. All right. Well, Dr. Helton, thanks for your input. So uh, did you use some moisturizer, even the guys out there, after you wash? Well, you know, the goal is not to have dry, cracked hands. You exactly. Need to moisture barrier. Yeah, you're, yeah. Right, you're right about that for several reasons. Uh, we appreciate it. Dr. Helton, thank you.